what is up my crazy subscriber this is joking john city 4 here bring us some call of duty black ops 2 gameplay in the background hopefully you guys do enjoy it. if you guys do make sure to leave a like on the video so anyways i'm pretty sure most of you guys do miss this game since uh most of you guys did start off in this game and also you can jump back in this game in like in the ps3 or on the xbox 360 anytime it's just that i'm pretty sure most of you guys do um, you know, hate the previous gen controllers. Like, I do hate the PS3 controller because I feel like it's like a brick. It feels too stiff and it's smaller than the, compared to the one from the PS4. The one in the PS4, it feels super comfortable in my hand. That controller is just made for gaming, so I do enjoy the one from the PS4. The one in the PS3 was the biggest mistake I ever done. I should have played on the Xbox 360. So, um, hopefully I don't get any death threats by that. By saying that <laughs> you know who I'm talking about Heather so anyways uh, moving on to the main topic of today which is about what do I miss about uh, Black Ops 2 so one of the main things that I do miss about Black Ops 2 has to be the weapons the weapons were well made uh, one of the weapons that the one I'm gonna name will be the Scorpion Evil which is the one that I'm currently holding right here that's the Scorpion Evil the last SMG to unlock uh, another SMG that I want to name will be the PDWR uh, the Vector CRB uh, MP7 and the MSMC. Now all these weapons were well made in the first six months of the game because in the first six months none of them were nerfed and they were well balanced, they were well done. It was just instant kills like with like uh, or like around one fourth of your mag or one third of your mag will be done every time you kill a person. Well what happened after the first six months was that the game got updated and nerfed every single weapon in the game. The assault rifles, the shotguns, the SMGs, all of them got nerfed and they all were super weak. Like it took more than half of the mag to actually kill somebody. So I don't know what the hell happened there. But the only weapons that were not even touched by the updates were the snipers. Which pretty much made this game into a sniping game afterwards. Like it was just all about quickscoping. And one of the main things that happened was that uh, the quickscoping community were always crying every single freaking week in the first six months of the game. That's why every single gun got nerfed because the quickscoping community... I always complained that the SMGs were just an instant kill, like, oh, it's too OP or whatever. Like, that's what caused the game to be nerfing every single gun out there. So, um, it was the quick scoping community's fault that this game got nerfed so badly. And then towards the end, everybody's just quick scoping the shit out of each other. And also, they killed Ground War. So, um, that's a sad moment right there because I had so much fun in this game only for the quick scoping community to ruin it towards the end. I can't even quick scope myself, and I'm a rusher 24 7. And before Black Ops 2, I never used to quick scope at all. So, that tells you something right there. I can quick scope even I don't even quick scope at all. Like it doesn't make any sense. So um so yeah, the the quick scoping community really killed this game towards the end back in 2013. So um, another thing that I miss about Black Ops 2 has to be the moments that I created here on Black Ops 2 with other YouTubers. Um I did create a lot of content on YouTube and a lot of people liked it. I got a lot of subs out of it. Uh, I met new YouTubers along the way. I supported new YouTubers, uh, some of the girl gamers out there like Miss Dead Wedge and Crazy KP and Epic Ninja Girl HD. All of these were, uh, were playing Black Ops 2 and I supported them along the way. And also we created moments by ourselves like funny live moments, um, face off battles, a day with and it was just total fun out there. And um, you know, I wish I had them earlier like back in Modern Warfare 3 but um, most of these people like started playing in Black Ops 2 so that's why I consider you know Black Ops 2 to be the best time that I ever had with some other youtubers compared to modern warfare 3 which i had an incredible time playing with clan members so like there is a big difference between the previous years like black ops 1 it was just all about me going solo and just owning everybody out there modern warfare 3 it was about clan and teammates and random ass people and that's about it and then black ops 2 it was all about youtubing because you know i did create a lot of good series here in black ops 2 and it was just youtube every single day so that's this is where my YouTube also kicked off off because um, I created a lot of cool series, so um so yeah that's why you know Black Ops 2 I consider it one of the also a fun game. It's just that in the second half of the year nobody was even playing this game anymore. So um another thing that I miss about Black Ops 2 not even the maps, not even the DLC, and um, I like kind of kind of like the soundtrack in the background. That's about it. So it's only the weapons and some of the situations that happen in Black Ops 2, and also the content that I created for this game. So, so that I say, if you guys want to see more Call of Duty, make sure you subscribe for more.